Hi, this is Tim. Today we're going to talk about the LEDs that are on the Allen Bradley CR30 Safety PLC. Because depending on how they're configured, they can really be a good tool to help you figure out what is preventing your system from running. Now the key to this is these LEDs do not actually correlate with anything on the PLC. They are fully configurable. Which means if the functional safety engineer chose to use them in their program, then it can be a great tool. But if they chose not to configure them, or what I find a lot of times is they don't know they exist, then they've left a big troubleshooting tool out of their toolbox. So first let's have a look at what we have. So right now we have input zero, one, and four on, and Let's just press a button. There we go. So I just pressed switch three and now none of them are on. So I pull switch three out. Okay, zero, one, and four come on. Let's pull switch four out. Then two, three, and five come on. So the question is, why did they come on and how did we figure that out? Well, that is in our CR30's main page configuration. Now guys, also when I open mine up, so here's something to be aware of, is mine actually looked like that. And so when you're looking at this, the only option you have is the edit logic. And okay, the edit logic took us to there and we know what that is. But if we go back here, no one, I just clicked that tab, but assuming that assumes that you left off exactly where I did in the last one. To get there, we can just double click on our GuardMaster 440C CR30 over here, and that'll take you to it. So let's just click off here, double click there, and yeah, that takes you there. But yeah, this is kind of vague down here. So if we just find that right spot on this line up here, you're gonna arrow that points up and down. And let's drag that up, and we're gonna see some amazing stuff down here. First, we have our serial port, which we're not actually using on this one. We also have our USB port, which we're gonna use in later videos, just so you know how to connect if you don't have the ethernet option. But then the next one is this LED configuration. And what this allows you to do is configure these LEDs any way you want. There are the input LEDs. And there are the output LEDs. And by default, they are not used. Here, we are using LED zero for terminal status zero, LED one for terminal status one, two for two, three to three. But just to show that, hey, it doesn't have to be a terminal status, number four is the safety monitoring function status. In other words, is our safety monitoring circuit good? And so this would be a very important one. And in later videos, we're going to actually exercise this a lot is if you were looking at, okay, my e-stops are good and maybe I even have them to the terminal configurations like I do where input zero and one go to switch three and inputs two and three go to switch four. But okay, and I can see those, but we have that monitoring circuit behind it. So what this would tell you is, hey, something's wrong with our monitoring circuit. So really quick using these LEDs in a really basic cheat sheet that we can put beside of our PLC without ever connecting to the PLC, we can probably troubleshoot our safety system. So we're going to have some exercises later going through that, but I just wanted to get your mind kind of planted on what those do. And also several of you have already asked about them is, Hey, I see these lighting up and they don't line up. So that's what they do. Again, please make sure you subscribe to our channel. This is a great series we're putting out right now. And hit that like button. Till next time. Hi, this is Tim. And this is Amber of TW Controls. We run the automation store. Hey, thanks for finding our channel. Here's a playlist with some similar videos. And YouTube thinks you'll like this video. Please like our video and subscribe to our channel. And if our videos have helped you make some money and you're not using our products, please consider supporting us on Patreon. Till next time. See ya.